level, I would say, even from Shine. Shine's gonna have to turn it all around, try some new builds, try something different because it's just not working out for him in this series. As you said, Echo is the map. Let's jump into that right now. Down here in the bottom right, in the blue, seems to be working out for these blue lit <laughs> blue Zergs tonight. Wolf, it is Bjell. <laughs> Does Valdez? Here's a shot of him. And over here, the top left in red, not working out so far for this guy so far. And uh oh, I was wondering about that critical time uh, in ZBZ. You always got to watch the supply get to nine. And watch those minerals go up. Are they going to go for a 10 pool? Or are they going to make an overlord oversupply as Shine's doing? It's going to be a 10 pool. So 10 pool bailing, it looks to be on the table here on the cards for Bill. And if he can do an 8 pool that fails, trade all of his links, get scouted on a two base lair and a speedling follow up, and still win the game, <laughs> I worry right now for Shine. I do. I really do as well. And I wonder what kind of build is Shine going to go for. I was talking about him mixing it up. He's not going to do anything aggressive, but will he play safe again this time? Again, another two-player map, but like I said before, maybe they told him, hey, stop playing safe. You know, you can hold this off. You know, just go for something different. Try to be greedy a bit, but it's not going to pay off for him in this game. Let's see how much he commits. Is he going to uh, commit oh to boy. extra drones? One extra drone, two extra drones. Does he go gas? Do we have a gas here? I feel like I'm at an auction. <laughs> <laughs> oh, looks like no gas, but it will be a pool. Sold. <laughs> 200 minerals for the spawning pool. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Did I hear gas? <laughs> he made another drone and then the gas and now the pool. Look at he how late is, that pool is. He is screwed, man. Man, he is, spell it with me, D-E-D, -E -D, man. <laughs> oh, look at those fans. They're not happy. She's got a Samsung Galaxy Note 3. Clearly a fan of uh, Shines here, but. Cancel on the gas. He sees the links coming across. Uh, but yeah. this is essentially a build order loss. I was talking about him mixing it up, but it's just not working out for him. Biela, very smart builds. Yep. And you know, it's funny, just, it's almost as if Shine uh, knew this didn't happen. He didn't want to play on these small maps. We're going to have those links on the ramp become Bane links. Actually, he can go all four. All four of those can become banelings. Come on, fourth oh, That's right. There you go. There you go. All the links are like, oh, man. <laughs> uh, holding this is virtually impossible. Without a queen, it's going to require godlike micro on the drones. One drone already falling. Okay. How's the micro? Splitting her up pretty well here, actually. But it just the matter is he can run around forever. If he can't mine, he's going to get overwhelmed. Ten more yeah. links on the way. And Bill, very smart. He's not going to use these banelings on the drones, I hope. He's going to wait for the links to pop out and just hit him right away. There you go. Your links are left over, and they can do the damage to the drones. Yep. And, uh, you know, not the best baneling hit there, but the damage is being done. Again, no mining during I mean, this whole time. Two queens are about to pop out, so this attack will end. But he's going to be left with three harvesters. Yeah, that's if, not if enough. If they survive, that is... Dell is back at home. He's got nine. He's got more stuff coming across the map. He's got a baneling nest. He's got gas. Oh, um, this is going to get weird because well, that's going to be really annoying to lose that overlord as well. But uh, Shine has three harvesters to nine, but he has two queens. So he's not going to die anytime soon. So this game could actually take a while to get ramped up. Well. I think Biel might want to just end it quickly with the uh, speed thing all oh, yeah. in. He is because, speed. I mean, there's three harvesters. Think about how long it takes you to get your 50 minerals, make your next harvester. Like, it's going to take forever. Queens are going to help out in defense, but not much else. This is like You're StarCraft larva. <laughs> StarCraft 1, 4 drones, except you only mine, you only mine 5 in StarCraft 2. Mm. Yeah, you're right. With the speed coming up here, it looks like he is just going to not even make more than 9 drones. 9's enough to keep making lanes. I mean, he's got the speed and the Bane lane nest. Don't forget it. True. And, uh, oh man, the links even squeaked through on those two queens on the ramp, and 
It's like you can't even lose a single drone, but he's losing mining time, which is basically the same thing at this point when you're down to seven harvesters. Oh, Shine desperately trying to get one drone, but he can't even. Oh! Oh, yeah, he got nice! It. <laughs> That's the Shine we love. Oh, that one drone? It's got the money! So he, I need to turn that in. Uh, well, I mean, speed's finished in just a second, which makes these even deadlier. That drone goes down to one lane. And he's just going to be able to either run into the main and kill everything, or if the queen stay on the ramp, just kill the hatchery. Either way, he wins. Uh, I mean, obviously, ideally, he'd like to get into the main base, but uh, all the queens come out, and... Okay. Please. I think he's just got enough stuff at this point that he can really do whatever he wants. He's, like, trying to bait the queens out, but in the meantime, he's going to get this hatch, and... He's just got more and more links coming across the map, sitting on eight drones. That's really good control by Shine, by the way. I'm, like, really impressed with exactly. He knows how far he can push the button. He's got several transfusers on each queen, so this is a... I mean, eventually he will break through. I mean, he's that far ahead. Like you said, he could basically do anything. Now they're out of energy, and he will get through. Oh, uh, giving more service here, here by mistake as well. Trying to help the, the queens get some more DPS with the other links coming in, but... Banelings, or he's like, oh, I just had some Banelings. That wouldn't have happened. Yeah. Uh, huh? Bill, I think he should have just taken out the hatchery, to be honest. Yeah, but I mean, I think he's still pretty much got this under control. Only one Baneling will finish here, but now we're going to be able to finish this queen off. GG. Bill, it's going to Star League 3-0. You know, kind of what we expected. We thought it was going to be a bit closer than that, though. And Bill just makes very quick work of it. His ZBZ is looking on point, where his Shine is not really showing up today, I have to say. And of course, they're uh, trying to play greedy in game number three, trying to get back in the series. He just gets cheesed out once again by Bill. That's the nature of ZBZ. It is so hard, especially in a best of five, to play from behind in this matchup. Yeah, and that's why we see a lot of 3-0s in this matchup. Uh, you get into someone's head, and exactly what probably Storage Controller is saying, and exactly what you were saying is, maybe it's time to change it up, man. Stop playing so safe. There's no way he's going to do something like that a third time in a row. You get into somebody's head like that, and ZBZ gets out of control, especially on two-player maps back-to-back-to-back to back to back like that. Yeah. Uh, Got a feel for Shine here, but Biel is definitely the better player. Yeah, I think he definitely deserves to make it through. Our next matchup is going to be SOS versus Solar. What we thought could be the most one-sided match of the night, but we're not sure. We'll see. That we will. Uh, it definitely could be Solar, one of the best CVPs in the, like 2014. We'll see how he's doing now. We'll see how it comes to it, guys. In 10 minutes, we'll be, re be right back.